Hey guys, today in this video we'll be taking a look at a very common problem that most of the beginners face, that why their model turns pink. Imagine you've been working on a project, saved all your work, shut down your computer and then reopened the file later. But you're seeing that all your models are turned pink and the textures are gone. Now it seems like you have to start from scratch. But guess what? There's no need to worry because I've got a simple solution for you guys. Before we go on, let me tell you about 3D dot design. Your world of captivating 3D character models, icons and more. Here you can find a lot of premium 3D packages along with avatars and fancy cars. Plus our 3D models work with any design tool such as After Effects, Photoshop, Figma, Blender, Premiere Pro and many more. Start a creative journey here for an immersive experience. Alright, so let's get back to the video. Ok, so right here I have a model opened in my Blender. I've downloaded it from Kitbash 3D and currently they have this on sale for free. Now, if I switch to the render mode, you can see I'm getting all the stuff in pink. None of the textures are working. Even if I go over to shading tab, you guys can see all the textures are linked but not working. And it's actually a dot blend file, you can see here, and also all of the textures are present in the same folder. The solution to this problem is really simple. All you need to do is to just come up here in the files section, then hover to external data and select for finding the missing files. This will open up a new Blender tab and from there you just need to locate the specific folder where the textures for your model are present. Once you're done locating the folder, simple select find missing files button and it will then start analyzing it and will fix all the textures that were missing from the model. It will actually take a couple of seconds as there are a lot of files to work on. But when it gets done, you can see how now our buildings have been loaded in with all their associated textures. So as if I want to zoom into this one, you can see how all of the textures are actually applied to this building now. So if you ever run into the issue where you open up a file and all of your textures are there and everything turns into pink, just remember to try file and then external data find missing files. And from there you can load your textures back. Now that you've loaded the textures, another problem that you might face is the pink environment. So let's say you have added a pretty good environment at first and then just normally work. But at some point you want to decide to check how the model would look in real time. But then what are you seeing that this time all your environment is turned pink? Well, the reason behind that would be you might have deleted or moved your HDRI texture to somewhere else and that's why you're facing a pink environment. So to fix that, you just need to relocate your HDRI texture and it will be back to normal. Also, keep the texture in the same folder once you loaded it to the environment, else it will turn to pink again. So that's basically how you can fix the missing textures in Blender. So that's pretty much for this video. If you find it helpful, consider subscribing and giving this a big thumbs up. Don't forget to check our vast library of 3D character models at 3D.Design. And I'll see you in the next one. Thanks.